Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I'm I'm excited for Watch Dogs too. But anyways, moving on. Matt, what's your topic? All right. So uh, recently, we've learned, if you haven't heard, uh, No Man's Sky got delayed to August 9th, which, I mean, I'm not too upset about. I mean, fine. They're, the they're, they're perfecting it. They're <laughs> polishing it. That's fine. I've got other games to play. There's other shit coming out. I, that's cool. I can wait. That being said, I know they've, they've talked a lot about it, but, I mean, not a vast amount of knowledge is out there for this game. Oh, no. So... You know, I was kind of discussing with my friends, like, what do you want to see out of this game? Because I don't, like, the game, it's such an amazing concept, but how long are you going to want to sit there and just travel to a planet, walk around, and leave? Like, is that all there is? Can't be. It's it's not. It's, it's not. I've researched a little bit more. I, I learned that there are, like, factions, apparently. There's factions. There's AI. Like There's AI. Uh, space I want, pirates. Space pirates. Like, I want... I want to be able to like go to a planet and discover like an alien race that you haven't seen before, and they're hostile. They're like, get the fuck off our planet, and you have to like fight aliens in this combat. I want that um, ship customization. Oh yeah, that's in there. I know. I think I've heard them say something about that. Yeah, which I, I mean, it's all about your ship. I would doubt there wouldn't be ship customization. Um, I hope there's like vast vast amounts of easter eggs in this game just nods to like a bunch of di- like i want to go to like a planet and see nods to like other games and shit so i'm such a sucker for easter eggs you know that it, you, you know it's going to be riddled with with see easter i don't eggs. know if it's going to be though because of the procedurally generated engine that's true because that's true it's going to be something that nobody has set foot on that's so true even the developers won't even know it right um that, that would be a hard game to do that with really Maybe something when you get towards the center of the galaxy. I, I don't know. That would be a really cool game though to do Easter eggs in, but I don't know how they would fit that in. Um, I want to play with friends. I want to travel space with friends. See, I, I want to too, but I don't know how that's gonna work. I know. Is it? It's supposed to be you know you're like a solo like yeah thing where this is you your adventure. Yeah. So, but that would be so cool though to just. Mm-hmm. We could like, hey, you could like have your group of friends, and you could go claim a planet, and just be like, "Yeah, this is this is our planet." Damn, I didn't even think about that until just now. Actually, you could like, you could like, like, okay, like you're with your group of friends, and you can like go to a planet, and you can like colonize, and you can like, you can start building on a planet, and you can like invite people to your your colony, and just start a civilization of your own. True. On a on a planet, and then and then you would have to like, you're in sp- like the vast amount of space. Maybe an alien attack. Like they don't like that you're on this planet. You have to defend your your. your I know there's something village. called like sen- sentinels, guardian. There, there's it's something like it's like space police. Yeah. Like and if you do certain things like that, they consider hostile on that planet. They will attack you. But I haven't seen any of these enemies. Like, they don't show... When they show these videos, they don't show that. They just show people walking around and stuff. But, like, they keep saying, like, okay, well, there's this. And then you see some of these space battles. But then you don't... You see all these other ships shooting at you, but who's piloting those ships? Yeah. Like, they have not shown any other type of alien species other than, like, animals and stuff that you see on planets. Right. Which... (sighs) I just I don't want the game to be bad. No, like, obviously, like, like I'm like, man, they could they could do they, things to make it amazing. They could also do things to it, have it crumble. I've just I've never witnessed a game that we we think we know a good chunk, but then when you really think about it, we don't really know too much about this game. No, and the way they're describing, yeah, it's probably a hard game to pitch and show because. Anytime you go to a planet, it's not rehearsed because it's all random. Right. It's good that they haven't talked about it much because it's 
mystery you know it's the mystery of the game is yeah. exploring space so they're not gonna they're not gonna try to show well, like, they probably don't even know how to explain it like, like you that's said, the thing like, because they're said, like, like it's so procedurally that's why generated said, like, it's like yeah that's why he said like when he uh gonna change anytime I mean, he did like gameplay demos at e3 because they were the same was because that was the first time he was playing on that like yeah on that uh uh on that planet like you can't really say what the game's so gonna wasn't be gonna like know like what yeah. was gonna happen you can't explain what the game's gonna be like if it changes all the time you can explain that you're in a ship and you travel space and you go to planets but yeah. it's, but beyond that not gonna really be able to show it like unless you sit there and you record gameplay for a long time and then just kind of split it up yeah but but then that ruins the fun out of it too because it's all about you know like you said too exploration Figure it out on your own. Just kind of venture out and do f- discover things. Name different species of fish and whatnot. Dude. Like, but it, it still gets you wondering, okay, my theory is still holding up with this whole No Man's Sky and VR. Yeah. I have a feeling that's why they delayed it. Even though they said they said key elements or something like that mm-hmm. for the reasoning. It's, I bet you anything, it's to make sure VR works well in it. Yeah. Because that game would be perfect. Perfect for Sony VR. Oh, man, VR. yeah. Like, I, ever since it was first talked about, I'm just like, man, that would be such a great game just to Fly sit back space. and, like, sit back in your gaming chair with the fucking headphone, the headset on and just get lost. Yeah. It would be so cool to be in the... and it And it's like... You're in the cockpit of your ship, and it's got, like, your HUD, like, just glass. Right. Your HUD everywhere. That'd be freaking cool. And then, like, even when you're out, like, about, like, the your helmet HUD and stuff, too. Yeah. Like, oh, God. I'm just, just thinking about it, like, just the possibilities. Like, that's what's crazy about this game. You don't, we don't know a lot about it. Yeah. But I don't want it to I don't want it to suck. Yeah. But I'm I'm glad they pushed it back though. That shows that they're at least taking their time with it and not rushing this game out like some games that we've talked about before. They still have not gotten a patch, by the way. <laughs> but I'm I'm really, really excited with No Man's Sky. I really wanted to like I wish there was a co-op feature in it, though. Like, yeah, just one of the things I'm hopeful for. But I, like, I'm not gonna be upset if they don't do it. Like, I'm, yeah, I wouldn't be upset either. Just there'd be a way to do it. Like, I know I understand they don't want people like just randomly being in the game. But like, say if you want to play with a friend. You can do like a tele, like make a teleporter or something. And yeah. Do it that way to join people's games, but oh man, it's just it, there's so much potential with it. I I I'm, I'm at a loss for words with it. I'm at a loss for that words. That about wraps it up. Yeah. My topic. 